Yes, he's beautiful soul, Sarava, and I said to you, I'm here with Asha. She's a good friend of mine here in southern Tasmania, and we are going to go for a little trek up in the forest to find a nice little ritual space. Mm. Now, for me to properly introduce you to Asha, I need to tell you that she is born of the pure earth. She is 100% <laughs> like wood nymph. <laughs> I am a creature, yes. She is a creature. Uh, what's your field of specialty? I, it's what is the name of it? Like I've asked you this before. We've done it. it. We've done it. Uh, I, I call it. What is it? Ah, deep ecology. Deep ecology. I, I can never. I, I do a lot with deep ecology. Yeah. Beautiful, and beautiful uh, inspiration. Yeah. yeah, that was beautiful. And I got to experience <laughs> her majestic deep ecology at dream farm during a retreat that mm. when was that authenticity it authenticity was, yes when was it oh time's not really my thing july yeah, yeah. we'll go with july <laughs> no right. it was in june because i was gone oh, all no. of july oh wow that's yeah. that's wow <laughs> we're about to go to another wow. one uh, mm. next weekend mm. which is expansion which will be really nice but uh this woman has the touch. She has the, <laughs> she has that way of walking into nature and just belonging there. And I think that that's a really rare gift, especially in this very modern world that we live in. Most individuals, they are drawn to nature, yes, but to be comfortable and peaceful without being concerned and being bitten by a spider <laughs> or snuck up upon <laughs> by a bear. <laughs> well, luckily we don't get bears here. We get koala bears. Koala. And I do, yeah, I've stared into the eye of a crocodile. It's not that bad. <laughs> yes, yes. So this is what we're doing. Yay! <laughs> So we have chosen our place to set up a circle and we're looking to set up an elemental circle outside. I've been wanting to set up a ritual space here on my property for a long time. And so it's time to do just that. So we have, we have a space sort of set up. It's taking shape. I'll show you around. It's hard to see now because we've only just started uh, placing down some, you know, some fallen forest matter and I disturbed a colony of like jack jumper ants over there. I lifted up the rock. <laughs> I lifted up the rock and I was like, oh, no, put it back down. <laughs> stop, stop. <laughs> that's being told to leave me alone. Um, they're, quite, they're quite nasty, their bites. They could be a little bit poisonous. And uh, anywho, but look at that. That's a beautiful space, that beautiful light. I know that the iPhone is blowing that right out at the moment. <laughs> Let me see if I can adjust the... Uh... There we go. Look at that. <laughs> That's a little bit better. <laughs> <laughs> and so we are going to um, look down at what we have created. Uh, we've created that sort of like little boundary all the way down here. And I'll show you up close. <laughs> technically trespassing on my neighbor's <laughs> land <laughs> just saying there's our boundary Hi. fence right there you can touch it <laughs> hypothetically also be electrocuted by it <laughs> options. options we don't know if it's live or not <laughs> there seem to be uh, remnants of like electric fences around whether or not they're active yeah but look at this it's quite big yeah we can go right in there Look at her. Oh, wow. You can live in there. 
I live here now. <laughs> so, after getting ridiculously lost for a little bit on my own property, it happens. I'm, I'm not the best with directions. <laughs> That's where we were over there. It was just, like it was the corner. We yeah. saw this corner from yeah. over there. If we yeah. kept walking, we would have got here eventually. Eventually, but... we would have. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so we found the um, area of bones. So this is our little boneyard around here, and there's more off to the side there, and there's more through there. So and in the neighbouring yard, there's some scattered there. So we have found the boneyard, and we are harvesting said bones for said magical circle. I am puffed. For those who own an Apple Watch, I closed all my freaking loops today with the exception of my Breathe app. It is not happy with me. It keeps saying Breathe. Apps. Sorry about that. <laughs> so you're being cheeky. What do you got there? I have ribs. Ribs. Massive ribs, like already almost making the circle. Oh my gosh. Yeah. That's nice. <laughs> yeah. And look at this incredible oh. through the barbed wire. Skull. Yin Yang Skull, we've called it. It's already got a name. <laughs> it's just, it's nice. I feel it is also important for me to say that these creatures died of natural causes. Uh, and they were just found on our property. They're bleached white. They've been here for a long time. We're putting their, their, their loveliness to good use right now. Hey, hey. Pretty baby. Pretty baby. get a little dark and a little windy mm. we worked up a sweat <laughs> yeah. the circle looks beautiful but it's not quite complete yet mm. we laid down all natural items fallen mm. twig and bone mm. and atta found beautiful what are they called abalone abalone, yeah. abalone shells mm. and a few other bits and pieces seaweed in the water corner and things yeah. like that and so it got a bit dark, so we're venturing down, and then I'll go down and I'll lay down herbs next, and I'll, mm. you know, I'll bring up candles and light a little fire in the middle, and you know, so beautiful. make the space. We even contemplated a little sacred weaving, some color mm. into the equation. Yeah. Okay? Bringing in some ceremony to make the space. Mm. Yeah, seems nice. Yeah. So, what are your thoughts of the um, space so far? It's beautiful. I love how. It just intuitively flowed in it really felt like and even just when we first arrived that was just like hello i'm a mossy glade for you to play in like it just felt like <laughs> oh we'll just move this rock here and this rock here and oh look it's a circle like it was ready it felt like it was the land everything was ready to we didn't have to work. clear it too much did no. we there was very yeah. little clearing we yeah. simply picked up what was debris and turned it into a circle <laughs> yeah, pretty much we didn't break anything. Yeah. We didn't pull anything off the ground. Everything we moved a little rock here. Everything got checked. Like we asked, oh, do you want to come? Oh, that rock's got ants under it. Oh, no. But everything yes, got, yes. everything was fully consenting and encouraging. And yeah, yeah, it's just so beautiful. This land here is so supportive. It's, it's very yeah. nice. It comes from the fact that I've been living on it for an entire mm, year. It knows. So My oh, blood is, is here. Okay. <laughs> it is. It is. This is, this is it. Oh, and, we know you. Know, you. you walk around here mm. enough and you sort of like... It gets used to your presence. Like it's not mm. like I just barreled in here and the moment I arrived I started moving things around. <laughs> like I've sat here for a while and we we are very careful with how much we move. We don't mm. cut things down and we don't rip things up and we don't do that type of thing here. So the mm. earth itself is quite passive yeah. and welcoming. Oh, you're a beautiful guardian for this space. Hope so. Let's see. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Let's see in summer so when the tiger snakes yeah. are like <laughs> They're all right. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. I just I'll try not to put down any food for them. Oh yeah, it's a good idea. <laughs> well, I hope you enjoyed this little uh, circle construction nature mm. hedge witchery talk because we were looking at the circle and it looked really 
really natural, really hedge witch. Mm. And, uh, and that's the title that I give to Atta here. <laughs> she just naturally is that way inclined. Mm. She's, a, she's a veil crosser, uh, like a veil yeah. walker. Definitely speak and, to the uh, nature. She does, yeah. and it's a beautiful thing. So mm. it has her little interesting touches, and mm. uh, and I'm just so excited to conduct ritual when it's ready. That's oh, going to yes. be so fun. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, beautiful souls, thanks for hanging out. Talk to you soon.